Hello YouTubers, let me tell you a story. Me and my family, uh, a couple of times a year, we always go to Comic Con. We go to the one in Birmingham, in England. And uh, my son is always on at me, Dad, Dad, one year you've got to dress up, you've got to do it, you've got to dress up like somebody, you've got to do the cosplay thing. And I was always ah, piss off, piss off, I'm not doing it. Well anyway, we ca this year we came across a store and it was called Greyland Films and this chap he was the uh, only dealer in the UK of these masks and I was trying them on and uh, the Freddy Krueger one was fantastic it looked real I was trying these masks on and anyway I come across this one the Terminator and I'm a massive Arnold fan and uh, he's been my hero since I was a kid well, you know, young and uh, my son said that's it dad, you've got to do the Terminator you've got to do it and I thought, oh bollocks so he talked me into it anyway, I'm going to do it this year at Comic Con I'm going to go as the Terminator and here is the mask now I've started a few little pieces and I'm going to do some videos telling you how I put this suit together. And I'm halfway through doing it. So it's an ongoing project. Okay? So here's the mask. Now, I've thought about it. And I see a lot of Terminators as the, you know, the leather coat biker look with the pump action shotgun. You know, that Terminator from the second and third films. But I've never seen anybody do... The Terminator from the first film, when he was the badass and he come to kill Sarah Connor. So I thought, for a change, I'm going to do that one. Now if you're a Terminator nerd, or a Terminator expert like me, you know that this is the wrong mask, because in the first film, he just had his eye shot out. He wasn't shot up, it was just the eye. So that's why he put the sunglasses on. But I'm having a bit of artistic license and I'm having this mask and I'm going to do the Terminator from Terminator 1. So I've been watching the film, freeze framing it, getting pictures off the internet, putting together the look of the Terminator, the original one. So here's the mask from Greyland Films. Right, now he told me how to put it on, stretch it across the back. And there you go. Okay, now I've had to cut a few pieces out of the eyes because it was like pressing on my eyes and it was hurting. So, there you go. So, so far, there's the mask. Right, so what else do I need? Sunglasses. A critical part of the Terminator look are the sunglasses. Now, in the original, he had glasses that was called gargoyles and they're, they're over a hundred pounds in money well I'm not paying that much so I bought these which was three pound from Primark and I thought that's more my price range three pound these was so they'll do them okay now bear in mind I'm not Adam Savage I'm not a genius like he is and I haven't got his money or his resources, so I'm making it as close as I can with the resources and the money that I've got. Okay, now I bought two pairs of these sunglasses, and I'm going to try with the idea of putting a LED light in the other one, so the eye lights up. But these are just the sunglasses. So there we have it, that's the beginnings of the Terminator, the Terminator. Okay, I've got the mask, the glasses, three quid. Now the mask was supposed to be £35, but because I put it on and went on his website, uh, he knocked a fiver off. So I paid £30 for this, but they're usually £35. Okay, 